Hello and welcome to a powerful interactive market analytics one-stop shop for the housing industry. This tool has been created to empower real estate professionals to understand and explain their local market beyond the typical wide-angle view. Let's begin. Your default view is a market-wide, seasonally adjusted, rolling 12-month view of median sales price. In the main viewing area, there is a set of bar charts showing year-over-year -year figures for three years of activity and a line chart showing a longer historical trend. You can drag your mouse across the line chart to look at the values and time periods for points on the curve. A circle will appear on the line when you have selected a point in time. Be careful here because you can also see values for points not on the line itself. If you would like to see a year-over-year -year view by month, click monthly in the upper right corner. Seasonal trends are more likely to come to light on the line chart in the monthly view. On the left side of the screen, note the section labeled Area. The default area is the entire region, but you can either scroll down through the available list of sub-areas, or type an area in the box provided. You can search by city, or zip code, or other available geographies. Below Area is a section called Breakouts. This is where you can include more specific variables for the housing stock in your market. Click one to further specify the market. Click another breakout to add another layer of depth. You can select up to two breakouts at a time. To unselect a breakout, click on it again. If you try to select a third breakout while two are selected, the first chosen breakout will unselect. Across the bottom are a series of clickable metrics. So far, we've been looking at median sales price. You can view the market by any of the given metrics. You can add breakouts to the metrics and you can specify any sub-area. At this point, our viewing area can get crowded. There is a little box in the corner of each chart that can expand or contract the view of each chart. You can share a chart or multiple charts with clients, colleagues, or the world at any time. Note the print, share, and email buttons in the lower left. Click the print button and a dialog will appear that states, just click on the charts you want to print. After you have selected a chart or charts, click print to see a printable page or PDF to create a linkable Adobe Acrobat file that can be saved to your computer. Now click share and follow the same path as print. You can share charts via several social media outlets visible at the top of the screen. Let's choose Twitter. You will be prompted to log into Twitter if you have not already done so. But if you are already logged in, the interactive tool will compose a share-worthy tweet for you. Even though email was also one of the options within Share, there is a separate button for it for added convenience. Click Email to follow the same path as you did for Print and Share. You can either copy and paste the link into an email message, or use the internal email tool by clicking the envelope at the top of the screen. Feedback is important. You can click the feedback link in the lower left or email feedback at 10kresearch.com. Also check the FAQ link to see if your question has already been answered. All real estate is local. Let's explore your local housing market together.